something completely different. We return finally to the Unhinged series, the Challenge series, Brain. It's been a minute, if you couldn't tell. We are playing uh, the first event of the episode, is the Derby event. Normal death match playing as Barbara Page in her Cadillac. And uh, she claims this will be her last competitive derby for a while as she, quote, has something to take care of. And I have no idea what that could possibly mean, but she didn't show any signs of leaving. So it's anybody's guess. Clone. Once again, I'm automatically going to remind everyone, remind everyone, or make it known ahead of time. I have not played Wreckfest in a bit, so if I miss some very easy hits, well, I can't possibly miss that one. Uh, that's my excuse. Oh, you have no excuse for that. There's no excuse for that! That is terrible driving! Okay, well, I shouldn't have opened my mouth. I just got baited by Ferb. Okay. I wasn't born yesterday. Oh, maybe I was. Maybe I'll just stop talking now. Wow, that wheel's not happy. I couldn't tell where Colin was. I didn't know if he was behind the wall or ahead of it. I killed Thrasher somehow with that. Okay, that did no damage. That did enough, barely. I just watched Thomas drive into that tire barrier that always catches the AI for some reason. Got it. Ow. Oh, it's a guessing game. I couldn't tell what the hell he was trying to do. He was doing a little dance or some shit. I was steering back and forth and I did. Trying to guess what the AI in this game is going to do is impossible because they don't know what they're going to do. Slap. Not slap, not slap, not slap. Yeah, like I said, missed easy hits because I'm my timing's off. Part of the reason why I started with the derby in the first place. Oof, I'm surprised they hit that to be honest. But I can only imagine if this is how my derby driving is going right now, I can only imagine my racing would be even worse. Well, that was a fucking mistake. I was gonna say, eventually I have to die here, right? I mean, I've been hit by nine different fucking cars. Ah, okay. Like I said, the AI don't know what they're doing, so how am I gonna figure it out? You fool! Ow! Oop. Bye, Hikari. Murder my clone! Get him out of here! A Natsuki's here? That's the first I've even seen of that car. And we're four minutes into this derby, and that's the first time I've seen her MR2. Oh, bye, Gemini. That was not great. Barely nicked Jake, but it was hard enough to ow. Wreck him. Hard enough to ow, yeah. Same. 
Hi Natsuki, you've parked in a dangerous location. And now you are very dead because Tyler has stolen that. Just like the real thing, buddy! Okay. Bye, Taylor. <laughs> you have all of the durability of a wet paper towel. <laughs> no! Bitch. No oh, good lords! Oh, good lord again! Oh, good lord a third time! Okay, that was a mistake. I'm dead. I didn't think that that hit would kill me. Alright. <sighs> Put me out of my misery because apparently I'm being defeated by a tire barrier. I really would have laughed if Steven Rowe just drove into me at that speed and died. Okay, the road in reverse, Terry, is not working. I'm stuck. That's my age, Steven. Oh! Poor target selection, Thomas. Well, uh, if this is Barbara's final competitive derby, it was quite competitive. 16 to Phineas's 6. And only uh, me, Amber, and Tyler producing 3 of note below that. The first actual race of the episode, and it's going to be the B-class race. B for Bone Breaker, I guess. I don't know. We are here with Ryan Stevens and his apparently Ford Granada. A bit of a downgrade from a Mustang, but... Tradition and durability are the benefits here, as the this Granada is a bit more durable than a Mustang. Plus, it's a tribute. Tribute to a person who's not dead, but is far from driving shape. Oh dear God! Oh, we have a. There's been a problem. Whoa. Oh, you're funny, buddy. Try again. Pinball wizard over here. Hmm. I was wondering about this. Clearly, Ryan remembers the last time he raced here. Where Jane spun him and caused him to die. That wasn't really a, a Stevens cause takeout there, but I think the message was sent.
No! Oh, look at that traction. Okay. Well, there was no getting around that, but it doesn't matter. Brian Stevens will take the the sort of uh, redemption victory here at Bonebreaker. And, I mean, I don't really know if he was the reason that uh, James crashed there, but... I mean, if he takes it as a personal win, I'm not exactly going to take it away from him. We're in Bleak City. This is only the second time we have used the racetrack here. We've used the arena multiple times, but for whatever reason, that's where the camera is. It's not even showing the course at all. Um, not really sure. That might have been a developer oversight. Anyway, uh, we are playing as myself. Four laps around here that'll run just over six minutes. So a bit lengthy for a midway race, but... Eh. It is the longest track in the game. It's kind of hard to avoid that. It's like Spa. This is the normal number of laps for a midway race, so just the matter that one lap here is a minute and a half. Whereas most other tracks, it's like, eh, 40 to 55 seconds. Maybe a minute. It depends on the car. Three, two, one, go. Okay. I missed. Ah! Uh, Bye, bitch. Oh, god damn it. Just reset. It's faster than being caught up in that gravity photon over there. Like there's some sort of just like unwritten black hole in the middle of that. And all of the morons just get caught up there and don't move. <coughs> Eat food that smell like that. Oh, God. This is like my third recording attempt because mom just walked by with something that my nose is not particularly agreeable with. It's like Taipei is the company. I don't even know what the food is and I frankly don't want to. I shouldn't really expect much else from you. Alright, press your luck! Oh, like fucking hell. That's like trying to turn into my old grandma's house. Er... I say that because it's the house I used to live at. Somehow I found a space. I don't always get that lucky. You don't always get that lucky. In any scenario like that. Real life or not. Safe to say that that corner wasn't really made with Wreckfest in mind. I mean, obviously not. This is based on a game from the 90s, but still. 
These cars just don't have the traction that uh, the vehicles from Carmageddon obviously did. Now, oh. looking at the map, I should, in theory, be safe as I hit that turn left, or hit that left turn this time. Should, keyword. I'm not. Sneak in there! Why did I just do that? I do that all the time on this track. I turned in too early and I just, like, bottomed myself out. And I know all the time in Blaz I do this track a lot, which I don't, but every time I have, I've done that. All, like, four of them. One, one before this in the Challenge Series. One when I first tried out the track, and I did it once on a whim. And I think in all four races I probably cut that corner a bit too sharp and caught that lip. Oh, that's a great place for that, huh? Oh. My, my soft suspension bounced me away from the dead vehicle. Go figure. E brake. I like to imagine this corner should be taken, but I honest to god don't have a clue. Through the grass. And that is a huge margin of victory. 25 seconds of the line might be longer than that. <laughs> yeah, 30. At the line over vert. Well, I see we found the other reason not to do this trek. Holy shit. Okay, front bumper just went through the roll cage there. Or at least it would have in real life, probably. But despite the fact, despite that fact, I did like four damage. Oh my god. I knew the second I hit that car that way that I wasn't getting that kill. With two randoms under you hanging around, there's no way that the, the vehicle that tiny at 30 health was staying in the field long enough for me to kill it.
Oh. It's not enough speed. God, get out of my way. I have done a, like a 540 in this exact space. How did you kill yourself? God damn it. Oh my lord above. There, at least I got one finally. Fuck! How the fuck is that a wrecking assist? I hit the motherfucker. Why'd I do that? And he died. I forgot the first rule of the Grand Duke. Nobody damages a Grand Duke unless the Grand Duke says you can damage it. No, that wasn't the fucking Grand Duke. No, I'm saying because I hit it. Oh. And I took like eight damage, but they took literally zero. You said that on this. I've said that on the show before. I know. I'm just not comfortable saying it. I'm not from Australia. I'm not from England, where they just throw that word around willy nilly. That's practically how they fucking say hello. Gib. Come on. Come on. Thanks. Cool. No. You gotta be. Oh, <laughs> something. Oh, what's, what's the matter? matter? All of a sudden, sudden you're not, not so, so eager to chase, chase after, after me, Mr. Mr. Rando. I thought you were talking to me, and I was like, no, <laughs> what I hit you once is I couldn't see you through the damn sunrise. No. That purple Grand Duke was very intent on wrecking me until I died. Now he's a little shy. Well, in any case... He never even died. You literally cannot- you literally, you literally could not kill that damn thing. Third and final uh, mid race. Now, coming off of the guest appearance, we are at Wreck NATO. Wreck to do, I don't, I don't know. Uh, six lap race shouldn't be too long here. We're playing as the uh, the Mad Cap Kappa herself. I've had a nickname for her every time I've introduced her, haven't I? Nobody else really gets that treatment, I'm aware. Mainly because it's harder to think of him. Again. Uh, 
Oh, it already has a clone here. Oh! I didn't need that rear bumper anyway, I don't know. I don't know what you heard. Ah, uh, I do kind of need to not hit the wall. That I do need. Oh, Ivan, you fool. Oh god, me, you fool. Oh god, me. Other me, you fool. Small Japanese cars are assaulting me. I wrecked someone. This keeps happening. Oh, bye, Suwako. Oh! Okay. Oh, yep, yeah, Nidori remembers 17. It seems like an eon ago, but Nidori still remembers. Wow. Well, you can't do it better than that. And she wasn't even trying to do that. Barbara's car just basically moonwalked his way off screen. And Minari got the big hit on Barbara, but didn't take her out or anything. I think that might have been her death. Oh yeah. So maybe Nidori counts that, who knows. Now I think the current objective should just be to survive the race. Which I think she will do. Somebody has already won the race. And most things looking more like a Pinto right now. I will, or she will be losing to her clone, though. Probably to somebody else in the Kappa species, like the Kappa mob. Who won? Ivan did. Followed by James, me, James, James, what the hell? Alright, <laughs> for the final race of the episode, I'm going to cap things off here with a seven lap race on Death Loop. Which, to be honest, the death factor isn't nearly as high here as you'd think, and certainly not nearly as much as Hellride or even Bonebreaker or Crash Canyon, heaven forbid. We're here with Scott Weber in his little uh, Z, 240Z. And, uh,. <laughs> Video aside, I've been here for an hour and a half recording, and I just want to get the episode over with. I have a picturesque sunset. Symbolic of the end of the episode, I guess. I don't know. It's a clusterfuck. I mean, it's lap one in a racing game. I guess what else do you possibly expect? Set it on my clone. Not many takers on the loop. That didn't sound too great on the suspension, I'm not going to lie. Am I gonna lap somebody already? Yes. I'm going to lap Ivan and someone else up ahead. Phineas, who I think is missing a tire. 
Or if it's not missing, it's not in good shape, whatever it is. Boing. Oh, that's a bad slide. That's also a dead car there. Okay, Auto Gear is having a stroke. Very good at that. Already basically halfway through the race. I don't have quite as big of a lead as I thought I would. Maybe this still hasn't been the most closely contested affair. I don't see that a whole lot of this episode has been. Oh, tire! Technically the track is, is a little more interesting because of how gimmicky it is. Because, uh... Well, this wouldn't be a very interesting race if I didn't have to deal with this loop, case in point. And now my lead is gone, all because of that. So yeah, I should never have opened my goddamn mouth. As I say, I swear to god if Jake is still there. Nittery is leading. I'm surprised she's not busy trying to wreck me. I must not be in the race or something. I'm dragging this bumper with me, I guess. I'll turn. Ah! I mean, you can only take so many near rips before the suspension just finally said fuck off. Okay, don't go on the left, because there is some stupidity happening there with someone. Well, that race was closer than it seemed like it was going to be on, like, lap four. Ah! The game tried to scare me one more time, but I saw that on the map. Although I think I'd have probably killed it if I hit it, because it was a van at two health. It already second. Tori, I keep... My brain just doesn't want to do that for some reason. Martine, Madison, my clone, Ryan, Colin. I never read through the standings in any other race. 